Assalamu alaikum friends, this is Sami from Civil Engineers and today I'm gonna talk about in this RCC slab but here are some common mistakes which has been done in this RCC slab but now they are not able to fix those mistakes which I'm telling you in this video. Let's start guys. This is RCC slab but we have already discussed that main bar and distribution bars dia should be changed from each other. The main dia and uh, the main bar dia should be more than its distribution bar. Here you can see here are main bars and distribution bars but the dia is same which is 12 millimeter. Distribution bar and main bar dia is 12 millimeter here right. Now you can see there are some other mistakes which I have to point out we have discussed in more videos about lapping length that the lapping length should be provided at the mid for slab for beam and column but here you can see this is support support means this is column right this is rcc column for this slab and this is beam right top beam but this you can see this is lapping length but I've already discussed in many videos that the lapping length should be not provided at the end of the supports. Okay, this is end of the support, so this is a big mistake. You should not provide lapping length at the end of the support like this. So it's wrong, right? Because here are more shear stresses at the end of the support. But lapping length should be provided at the mid on that point. Okay, this is RCC slab, so it should be provided on the mid. But now here you can see this is provided at the end of the support. So it's wrong. Right? Here is the other mistake. Already, already they have done this mistake. Which is about uh, its lapping length. We have already discussed that the lapping length should be not provided at the same point. Two mistakes are present here. You can see in this point. One is lapping length is provided at the end of the support. So it's wrong. Now you can see this is lapping length. This is also lapping length and this is also lapping length. This is also lapping length so you can go there, okay? So it's lapping length. But lapping length is provided at the same point. So it should be not provided at the same point, okay? So we have to provide lapping length on the different points, okay? Because it can make uh, the RCC slap weak, okay? So it's very important. Now there is some other mistakes I have to discuss. You can see this is farm work wood farm work right but it's open they should use plaster to giant these but it's open during concrete work it's making bleeding but bleeding is a danger thing because uh, if any slab or if any concrete make bleeding so it's a danger for the concrete it makes the concrete weak right you can see the farm work all the farm work is open but now they are not able to fix these because the RCC uh, work is being placed on this slab. You can see the farm work. So farm work mistake, lapping length mistake, right? But here you can see some other mistakes here about its spacing. You can see the spacing is a difference, right? Here this is about 4 inches. You can see this is 5 inches. Right, spacing problems, lapping length problem, right? But here is the other mistake. You can see here stirrups, which dia is six millimeter. This is RCC beam, top beam, and total numbers of steel bars are used here. Seven numbers of steel bars, three at this side and three on this side. One is at the mid and each steel dia is 16 millimeters so it's okay but if you come to its stirrup stirrup spacing is wrong that's why because it's here seven inches but it's about eight inches but we have already discussed at the end of the support the stirrup should be closely we have already discussed but it's not closely at same distance right at the mid it should be more okay but space the spacing is same this is the other mistake so you can see here they used here the mud for closing the giants of farm work but what about this one this one you can see for all the farm work is wrong okay so it's danger during concreting work the slab will be weak you can see guys 
it's up to you i can't say anything about this so now you think is it mistake or not look at this all the farm work it's open so rough work you should not do it like this right so this is a video to discuss about some common errors which many people and many laborers and also the contractor and if the site engineer is present they also ignore these points but you should not ignore these points because these are common errors so guys thanks for watching see you next video goodbye